Oh my god, I love the anime run. It's so good. Boy, oh boy. That's a lot of energy. That's funny coming from yeah. you. All right, let's finish this Wutai. This Wutai mission. But there's a there's something over here that we want to go take a look at. Right? I'm just going to pop out. Today yeah! <laughs> Oh no. Boom. <laughs> Nothing's gonna pop out and be like, ah! Are you high potion obtained? Cool. What's up here though? Oh, this is just the other direction from which we came. All right, let's do this. One, avoid training when you can. Two, protect Wu Tai at all costs. Three, ugly Shinra soldier dudes must be punished. Who's this? Who are you? That's not Yuffie. I'm Wu Tai's greatest warrior. It's over for you because now you have to face me. A little kid? This area is not safe for you. Go on home now. You want to <laughs> going home? If you want to go any further, you're gonna have to go through me. Oh my God, so cute! Oh man, what am I supposed to do here? We're just gonna dodge, dude. We're just gonna dodge. Shoo -shoo -ha. <laughs> you got me! Ha ha! That'll teach you to mess with me. Once again, I saved Wu Tai. Oh my god, I love the anime run. It's so good. Boy, oh boy. That's a lot of energy. That's funny coming from now, you. Back to work. I'm confused though, because like, is this a. This feels like a simulation still. Like, we're in Wu Tai. Like, we did a trip to Wu Tai, but like. It still feels like a simulation just because of like the battle mode or combat mode. So, how would they know who the hell Yuffie is? So, is that more for our benefit of. Of like the player, the viewer, rather than like the actual story? <clears throat> Oh shit. Two of them. You must be the anti soldier monsters. Activating combat mode. Okay, yikes. Dealing with enemy abilities. Some enemy abilities, uh, you, sorry, some um, enemies use special abilities in battle. When these abilities are activated, the enemy will enter casting phase and an ability gauge will be displayed. You can lower the gauge by attacking the enemy, which in turn decreases the ability's impact. Furthermore, if you can reduce the gauge to zero within the allotted time, you can cancel the ability. Ah! Oh, he just picked me right up. Whoa. 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 All right, let's lock on one of them. Can, are they immune to anything? Whew. Yikes. What's happening now? Zach, let's go. Right. I'm ready to be a hero. Warm-up's over. 
Prove your honor to me. Rush assault. I got it. He went full fists, man. Wow, what a move. Go. When Zack experiences points reach a certain experience points reach a certain value, the DMW will sometimes stop at 777, in which case Zack will level up and his status parameters will be strengthened. It is not possible to check actual experience points. Okay. Get out! Get out! No, no, get out! Woo! I'll use the, my I'll use my heal potion. Bringing out the big guns. I saw that I had a break, Prove so we'll use that as well. I got it. Maybe I should have used that, like, after I had stopped their abilities. No, no. We have another break? I see break, but I don't... Can't activate it. My controller! Right, go down! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Alright, you're dead. You're dead. Sword move. Soldier second class Zack. Victorious again. Good work. Now, get out of there. You've only got five minutes. Got what? It. Director Lazard, are you watching? <laughs> yeah, so it is a simulation. Another one. No time to play. Sick. Seriously, the music in this game too is top tier. Oh no! Get up, dude! That's one more you owe me. <laughs> you lost your focus. Uh, yeah. Oh, sorry if your sword got any wear, tear, or rust on it. <laughs> You're a little more important than my sword. But just a little. I like him. Thanks.
I'm here. I must apologize. Being on site is taxing. Okay, but so they're not. In. Okay. You didn't have to come personally. <laughs> this operation will bring an end to the war. I wanted to see it through. So it is an actual mission. Soldier second class Zach. Sir! You put forth a good effort at Fort Tamblin. I saw it with my own eyes. To be frank, my evaluation is... Your work here far exceeded my expectations. Keep this up, and the day you make first may not be far off. And Jill, you were right about him. He definitely has potential. <laughs> we'll see. I can say this now, but when Angeal first recommended you, I was skeptical. At that time, all I'd ever seen you do were squats. <laughs> hey, we got a phoenix down! Zack, let's go. Sephiroth is waiting. Sephiroth? The hero? Ooh. Wow! I'm gonna meet a hero! Heightened emotions have affected the D DMW Sephiroth. Activating combat mode. Oh man. Take that. Oh, let's see what this break is. Concentrate. I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. Oh yeah. Result. Zach, come on. <laughs> it's like quit fooling around back there. Zach, take the director to safety. Contact Sephiroth. Zach can handle it. Now go. Follow me, director. I don't know why I thought this like was a simulation. I think mostly just because of the combat mode stuff. Director Lazard. Oh, thank goodness you're safe. Zach, I should be fine now. Assist and Geo. Yeah, I'm on it. All right, we'll go ahead and do a save. Do a little save, a little save, save. No new missions. All right, let's go. Wait, I still need to prepare. I'm coming, Angeal. I'm coming. Angeal. Angeal. What? These guys aren't Muay Thai troops. <sighs> Someone just summoned Ifrit? A summon? Who called it out? The fact that I just I just uh, I, I just got that? The fact that I just got that, I'm I'm so proud of myself for coming along as a as a Final Fantasy player. Oh my god, I am so excited. Oh no. I forgot. I keep wanting to press square as my... Oh, man. He's not gonna give me time. Missed. Oh, my God. I do have I do have my little limit. It's over there on the right-hand side. I keep saying break, and then I'm like, okay, now I can do this, but... 
coming out of this, I'm gonna try to hit him with. Oh, he got Hellfire off that quick? Oh man, what a move. I don't know how we we survive this. <laughs> I don't know how we survive that. Yeah, so that that can't go off. That cannot go off. Activating combat mode. Woo! Uh, just, just stay out of it. Better run for it. Oh, I guess I could use the break when he goes to cast that. Maybe he goes tries to do it now. Again. Concentrate. I'm feeling it. Not getting as much damage this time. Try to heal myself up. No. All right. So maybe we don't. I gotta see this a couple times before. I love the fact that it's like fully rendered. Do we survive this though? Can I jump? Can I dodge it? No, I can't dodge it. We did live. We did live. Oh no. Keep moving, just keep moving. Keep my health up. Oh man. Oh my god, I gotta stop doing that. If you can stop moving for a second. There we go. Some better damage. No! I didn't happen to see my health. We're going to skip this one. I... Oh man. Get up! Did not take advantage of that. Running low on MP. myself up. Get out. Get in. Alright, that should not hit me that for that much. <laughs> this should not hit me for that much. Yeah, only 200. Bye! Woo! Woo! 
Who had the Ifrit summon now? Oh no, stop turning your back on things. Stop thinking you've won when you haven't yet. Oh shit. I don't know why I act, like why I act surprised. Holy. When I see these characters, I know they're going to be in the game. <laughs> oh, Genesis. The missing soldier first class? They're identical. What? A Genesis copy. Copy? A human copy? Where's Angeal? I thought he was fighting around here. So he's gone too. What? Wait, what does that mean? It means Angeal has betrayed us as well. No way. I know what kind of guy Angeal is, and he never do that. You're on the wrong side, Zach. <laughs> Angeal wouldn't betray us. Never! The sad part about this is that the Crisis Core reunion. The sad part about this is that Zach would get promoted to f to first class just out of necessity to have first class soldiers. Like he would get promoted just because of the first class pool in soldier just dwindling, which is sad. Like he wanted, he wants to be first class so bad, but he's just gonna get it because of like default. More squats. What's with Angeal? How long is he gonna slack off like this? It's already been a month. Sephiroth's no help either. Lumping Angeal together with Genesis. Genesis is a deserter who took a bunch of seconds and thirds along with him. He used copies of himself to attack us. Angeal wouldn't condone something like that. His soldier honor means way too much to him. Everything's so messed up now. Angeal, just come back to us. That would be me. Who is this? Director Lazard wants to see you. Go to the briefing room. Hey, wait! Who was that? Who indeed? Any word on Angeal? He hasn't contacted his family either. <sighs> so what's this about? A new assignment. I want you to go to the hometown of our missing soldier first class, Genesis. Huh? According to the parents, they've had no contact with Genesis whatsoever. But they can't be trusted. Why? They're his family. Yeah, I was going to say, mm -hmm. don't be a dummy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I had already dispatched some staff, but we've lost contact. I want you to go and investigate. He will go with you. Song of the Turks. Song! This job is looking really gloomy. Hmm. Let me know when you're ready to go. I like how um, Song has been added to the DMW and a new limit break has been unlocked. Sick airstrike. I like how Zack is like the Sora of Final Fantasy VII. And I very much identify with that type of character. Uh, a little bit airheaded y. <laughs> like, like, you can count on us, like, at sometimes, like in the clutch, I would say. Um, but for the most part, we're, 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 <laughs> we're kind of dumb. <laughs> when Zack's emotions are heightened and the bond between him and one, several, one of several characters grows stronger, the character image 
will be added to the DMW. The DMW is connected to Zach's memories, and when the new image, or when a new image is added, certain memories may play as images from Zach's heart. Oh, I like that. Which is what we've been seeing. Little images here and there. Or videos. Oh, excuse me. Uh, hello? Oh, hey. It's Tunsil. Did you read my mail? No. Not yet. I'll read it later. I'm in a meeting in the briefing room right now. Gotcha. Hey, can I talk to you after that? I'm kind of busy, but if you can keep it short... Yeah, that's fine. All right, I'll be outside the briefing room. When you acquire a summon materia, the DMW will sometimes enter summon mode where all the real images change to summons. When all three reels match, you can call forth powerful summons like Ifrit. So register your missions where you can acquire summon materia. Makes sense. Example, mission 8, 1-1 rematch with Ifrit. All right, so let's take a look at what I think about Angeal. It seems every soldier of first class has a quirk, or three, but I think Angeal has a lot of common sense in this trustworthy fellow. Let's face it, Genesis never found group activities appealing, so Angeal is in fact the spiritual leader of soldier. I've got a lot of respect for him too, and I envy you for getting to work with him so often. Hmm. Interesting. Oh, this is more useful tips. If you acquire the item below, Efrit's image will be added to the DMW. Mission reward. When all three... Okay, we got that. Uh, obtain... Tonberry's knife? Um, I remember Tonberry <laughs> absolutely effing me up. Absolutely effing me up in... Remake. When all three images... My guess is those are going to be harder too. Mission 10 or M10. <laughs> All right. So let's talk to you. Oh, give me a minute. Hurry then. Give me a minute. Are we supposed to talk to Kunsel outside the, the meeting room? The briefing room? Is this it? Before you go out on a mission, you should always remember to check the supply pod. You know, because we're not notified when it's been restocked. Okay. Rumor has it that it's because of the company's cost-cutting measures. Well, if people keep lose like leaving and we're not doing any missions, how are we making money? Thunder obtained! Cool. Um, so if I go to Materia, I've got Cure, Fire, Blizzard's doing well. Why well, Blizzard? Bl I didn't realize I got Blizzard Blade. We won't. Switch to SP Convert. What's that mean? I don't know what SP Convert means. Um, let's, let's change it in equipment, I guess. Assault Twister. I'm assuming Blizzard Blade's better. <laughs> uh, we'll max out these before I add in thun Thunder. Right. Makes the most sense. Uh, Assault Twister we haven't... We haven't used... Oh, I say... I thought... Uh, never mind. Okay, so it's... Well, that is 14, but it also costs 14 AP. All right, whatever. Wadevsky's, all right, so he was outside the briefing room, right? Let's go talk to him. Hey, Zach. Word of advice? You should go places and do stuff before missions. You know, so you don't have any regrets. So. What do you say we go down to one and head to sector eight? Down to one and head, sure.
Sector 8 Fountain. Here we are. Sector 8. Sector 8's nice looking. Okay. Now we should split up. Why are we splitting up? What are we doing? Wait, what? You brought me here just to ditch me? Don't you get it? This is for you. You usually have so little time before assignments, and you can get more done if you're on your own. If you want to go back, go that way. See you, Zach. I'll be in touch. <clears throat> Interesting. Why are we down here? <laughs> All right, so I talk to people. This is Sector Eight, the place for entertainment. If you walk from the fountain toward the clock tower, you'll get to Loveless Avenue. If you go up the stairs there, you can go to the Sector One station. From the station, you can catch a train to the Sector Five slums. Why, why would we want to do that, though? So. I guess we'll do a little world building, huh? Ellen? Excuse me, but are you with Soldier? Soldier Operative Zack, yes. Zack? I've never heard of you. You must be Soldier Second Rate. Sephiroth fan. <laughs> we were just talking about who the greatest Soldier member is. For me, it's Angeal. He's so straight-laced and thrifty to boot. So, are these like are these members of Soldier? Are, do they have like trading cards? Like, are they? Do they have like commercials? Are they on ads? Like, why? I just it's just interesting to me that like uh, members of like a military group are so well known and famous. If we're talking about the greatest in Soldier, I can't think of anyone other than Sephiroth. Just imagining him walking around shirtless is enough to make me swoon. Uh, there is some crazy stuff on Twitter. <laughs> Maybe you should go there. You two don't know what you're talking about. This is the age of Genesis. There's nobody better in Soldier than him. Uh, newsflash, lady. Genesis isn't in, isn't in Soldier anymore. Soldier first classes have a big female following, it looks like. Interesting. Within Soldier, there's no one more popular than the hero Sephiroth. Which explains why he has so many fan clubs, from big to small, casual to utterly devoted. There's just too many to count. That's why it's important to look for a fan club that suits your needs. <laughs> okay. Uh... Would you like to join Keepers of Honor, a fan club dedicated to Angeal? If you join now, you'll get our recent newsletters that include bits of Angeal's official profile. Uh, no, not interested. Angeal's fan club or what Genesis? What Genesis' fan club apart is that we're better funded than other fan clubs. We have a very generous sponsor that's backing us. And we sell various merchandise, too. How about it? Would you like to join Red Leather, the premier Genesis Red fan Leather. club? I f so here's the thing. We're supposed to be finding out information on Genesis. I think fo following Genesis fan club would be the best. I'm not sure whether or not we can we can do both. So um, just knowing that like part of this the next mission or whatever, or just part of the game is finding out more about Genesis. Um, it seems like. So I'm gonna go count me in. New membership, you automatically gain a chance to win a replica of Genesis's rapier. That's oh. cool. It looks like you just received your first newsletter. Can I join? Like to join Keepers of Honor? Right, so I can do both. Dedicated to Angeal? If you join now, you'll get our recent newsletters that include bits of Angeal's official profile. I would love to join. Welcome. You are now an official member of Keepers of Honor. See? You just received your first newsletter. Sephiroth doesn't have one though. Oh, we also have dialogue We're options now for each. In an age where style is valued more than anything. 
Soldier is no exception to this. That's why the future of Shinra has to be the red-coated, impeccably stylish Genesis. You see? You see? So, as fans of Genesis, we should keep our activities classy and stylish. Okay. We can't lag behind Genesis and Sephiroth fans. We have to always stay active. As steadfast fans of Angeal, we must always strive to keep our activities earnest and honorable. Do we have... We can't lag behind okay, so it's the same. It's the same. Alright, so we have some mail. Okay, so Genesis, Genesis Fan Club newsletter 666, or 666, yikes. The issue is for the newcomers to Red Leather. As a welcome gift, here is some basic information about Genesis. Hobby. Reading. He happened upon a copy of Loveless in his parents' study and has been his favorite work ever since. Why he joined Soldier, the heroics of Sephiroth, who is the same age as Genesis, inspired him to work for the good of the world. We will update you on any new information as it becomes available. Interesting. Okay. Genesis girls. <laughs> and Geo Fan Club, newsletter 311. Hello, fan club members. Let's take a look at another peek into Angeal's unauthorized profile. The favorite hobby, doting over dogs. The bigger the hassle, the cuter the dog. Favorite read, Famous Gardens Monthly. <laughs> Magazine on various flora, published by Shinra. Now, it isn't that just the noble, nature-loving man we all know and love. That's all for this update. We'll let you know when you have more to share. Uh, I wonder if, like, 311 and 666, like, what these numbers... Because I always feel like there's, like, there's, like, a biblical... So, like, Genesis 666, um, Angeal 311. Is Angeal in the Bible? Like, just, like, there's a, a bit of a biblical thing with these. <laughs> I should look that up afterward and report back my findings. All right, so we've talked to both of them, or all of them. Anything over here? We can dash. Nice. Woo. Let's talk to this person first. I don't know what this Angeal person is about, but mom's become a groupie, so she pays zero attention to me. Oh, poor kid. I feel so lonely. Poor kid. You don't talk. Oh, come on. Can I walk? No, I can't walk through there. Talk to any of you two? No. I'm also, I'm looking at artwork to see whether or not we have like a... That get up. Are you with that Shinra outfit soldier? I hate Shinra with a passion. I want nothing to do with you. If we have like an avalanche, um, is it Spot? I forgot the name of the dog. Does this take us to the station? I'm sorry, but soldier guys don't interest me. Yeah. Sector Station 1 platform. So we don't want to go. I don't want to go that way yet. I don't, I don't want to leave and go to the slums. Talk to you? Lately, we're seeing more and more reporters sniffing around for a scoop on Shinra. I was chasing after one who had snuck inside the building. But I lost him. We absolutely cannot allow confidential information to leak to the public. I will catch him. Hmm. Can we talk to you two? No. Loveless Avenue. Who are you? No. Oh, thanks for patrolling Midgar. You're with Soldier, I see. But what business do you have here? 
Well, no business, really. It is the duty of the 18th Squad of the Shinra Security Department to patrol the streets of Sector 8. Anyone who disturbs the peace in Sector 8, soldier or not, will be dealt with. Okay. Quo now. Take it easy there, guy. I don't think you can stand a chance, to be honest. This is actually good timing. I have something to say. What Midgar needs right now is not soldier. Um, what do you mean? Who is it that finds lost children and takes them back to their mothers? Who is it that catches the crooks who steal change from vending machines? Who is it that warns young people talking loudly on their phones in trains? <laughs> yes, thank you for doing your service. That is all us. So, who Midgar really needs is the Shinra Security Department. Yeah, uh, thanks for your service. <laughs> See what I mean? <laughs> you won't be so arrogant for much longer. We'll be holding a joint training session with soldiers soon. Okay. <laughs> Security against soldier. We'll find out soon enough who the true elites are. Oh, man. A new mission has been added. Cool. I mean, um, you're talking about, like, heightened, like, genetically altered soldiers, right? It's soldier and the Turks that always get the attention. But that's about to end. At this next joint training session, the security department will prove its worth. Okay. Okay there, guy. <laughs> Talk to either of you. What about these kids? I mean, this is a lot of exploring. This is a lot of exploring. Uh, I don't know where, where that probably leads us back out. Oh, a soldier guy. Sorry, not interested. That's okay. Apologies, but my heart's already set on someone else. Oh, all right. I wasn't coming up to, to ask you out, so that's cool. This is the busiest part of Sector 8, nicknamed Loveless Avenue. Loveless is considered a literary masterpiece. They've even made it into a play. Cool. Hey, lady. Hey, it's a chocobo. Anything over here? Don't look like it. I do enjoy the world building, though. Didn't we just talk to you? Loveless. An epic tale of doomed love and shattered friendships. It's a classic that's even been adapted for the stage, and a production is put on every year. I am a member of the study group, a fan club devoted to Genesis. Another study group? We study Loveless to gain deeper insight into the work that Genesis loves so much. We began as a group that studied the Loveless text within Red Leather, another Genesis fan club. Uh, okay. However, we grew tired of the shallow fandom prevalent in Red Leather. So we broke off from them. I was going to say that the letter that they sent me wasn't very wasn't very deep in information. So, would you like to join the study group and delve deep into the Loveless text? Like Genesis? Uh, yes, please. Sure, I'll join. Welcome. You are now a fellow worshiper of Loveless. Oh, I think you just got new mail. Why don't you take a look? Okay. We'll take a look. I should to actually talk to them again. An invitation to Loveless. Loveless on stage is a popular as popular as ever. This year's production retains the love story from the female point of view, with a focus on acts two and three as usual. This interpretation features additional scenes of the two friends, making it closer to the original text. Acts two and three of Loveless have become famous thanks to the plays, but pundits agree that the story's true value lies in its act, excuse me, four. Uh, could this production, this year's production make up for it? Join us at the theater as we decide for ourselves. All right, yeah, we went to, went to just... Loveless is an epic poem constructed in five acts, but the final act has been lost and its content is unknown. Hmm. Acts two and three, though, have practically become common knowledge at this point. There is a stage version, after all. Genesis and his research into Loveless have gained a lot of attention in some academic circles. Interesting. <laughs> 
Uh, you don't talk. Am I right here? It can hit 140 mph. Hey, that truck looks very familiar. No, it can't. <laughs> it's got a good engine, of course, but the real secret is in those tires. Good to know. Do you say the Am same right thing again? It can, yep. It's got a good engine. All right, so we got some more mail. Personal announcement, 002. Effective today, Rufus Shinra has been appointed to vice president and corporate officer. Additionally, Rufus Shinra has departed on a long-term business trip, the details of which cannot be disclosed for security reasons. Interesting. Yeah, I still don't know, like, what the timeline is from the events of Final Fantasy VII and this game. You're with Soldier? N n nothing to see here. I'm a c c civilian, and I'm very busy. Please don't talk to me. He's got drugs up his butt. Ten, ten bucks. Ten bucks. That's where they are. All right. Do 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 do. Where's this? Where did this go? Or could I just not go there? No. Alright, I think we looked everywhere in here. And I think we talked to everybody that we could talk to. Including that rude guy. Including that rude guy. So, I think that's going to do it for this episode. Maybe we'll take a look at the uh, Sector 5 slums in uh, Episode 3. Um, it's very, very interesting so far. Um, in retrospect, after that first episode where we fought a bunch of sh uh, Shinra soldiers uh, or security got people, I'm now wondering, because um, Angeal said that they were dressed, they were, they were Wutai dressed as Shinra's security. So I I'm wondering if he had been training us uh to defect this entire time possibly but we'll find out more in the next episode guys go forth the rest of your day make it a good one don't forget to like comment subscribe and uh we'll see you in the next episode take care uh, bye bye uh, bye bye